Hi, I'm Kirsten Holmes, and here's what's happening. It is official. PG&E has filed for bankruptcy. The largest utility in the U.S. is facing billions of dollars in potential damages from recent California wildfires. So why should you care? The thousands of survivors from these wildfires are worried that PG&E's bankruptcy will leave them hanging out to dry with no compensation for their losses. So what about your rates? Weeks ago, before filing for bankruptcy, PG&E asked for a 6% increase in electrical rates starting next year. Any increases must be approved by the California Public Utilities Commission. But the last time PG&E filed for bankruptcy in 2001, our rates eventually went up. Now, we showed you this video, you see it on your screen right now, of a Best Buy employee running after someone was running from police in the Best Buy parking lot, but running after people is against Best Buy's policy, and that guy was let go. But now, Best Buy is messaging us saying that they will offer him his job back. They wrote, we made a decision to terminate our employee for violating our clear policies, but have had reason to take another look at what happened. They went on to say, we regret our initial decision and will be offering him his job back. And listen to this, Apple is facing questions over FaceTime. Yeah, a bug found in FaceTime could let someone listen to your conversations even if you didn't accept the call. It appears to be centered on the group FaceTime feature, which Apple added in iOS 12. Now, Apple has disabled group FaceTime completely and says a patch to fix the bug will be pushed out later this week. All right, so let's get a check of your forecast. It has been a couple of nice days. How long mm. would it last? Let's get over to Brittany with answers. Hey, Brittany. You know, it's going to change. So as we head out for the day, as we take a look at the day as a whole, earlier we were concerned with fog. And as we roll into the day until the afternoon, we're going to be watching light showers. Not enough to cause a lot of problems, but just enough that the roadways will be wet and slippery and it could cause an issue. As we take a look at the week in general, we're going to see bigger rain uh, problems later in this week. And our radar really backing up that story. You can see as we roll into tomorrow evening, that's when we'll start to watch out for rain and as you roll into Thursday morning. So I'll be working on Thursday morning. I'll make sure to update you. As we take a look, the Bay Area, a high of 59, the Valley 64, the Hills 64, and Sierra, we are looking at 47. As we take a look at your 10-day forecast, guys, you can see it. Chance of showers on Wednesday, Thursday, rain on Friday, and then just roll into the weekend. You won't want to do yard work because we have a chance of showers. But as we roll into next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we are looking at sunny. So completely different story. We just got to get through this week. And, of course, we'll update you throughout the day.